This is totally unacceptable. I'm docking her pay. She's 15 minutes late. And also, you're not the boss. You know, being 15 minutes late is not cool, Greg. You might think it's cool, but it's not. I don't think it's cool, but I think that I know Libby. <laughs> and I know that Libby... <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> that name. Libby. <laughs> I haven't been the same since you dumped me. Tell me about the fattest woman you've ever had sex with. You're okay. Sorry I'm late. <laughs> Libby? Is that you? Oh, Libby, this is totally unacceptable. What's the most effective punishment we can impose? Let me think about that. And just so you all know, this is my last day. Wait, what? What? I've had an offer of work from another company and I've decided to take it. What other company? They're called Scrub and Rub. <gasps> Our rivals. I'll get started on the patio. This is the worst day of my life. What would you prefer up your bum? A dog's paw or a man's hand? Hey. Hi. So, leaving. That's like, whoa, out of nowhere. You know, mind blown. Star Trek godlike alien of the week. I am so sorry I just mentioned Star Trek. That is so lame. Forget about it. So how did this happen? I've had enough. I don't know if you've noticed, but these people are crazy. Yeah, I did notice that. I have been trapped in three different rooms since working in this job. Three. And Magda is a control freak. She thinks she's the boss, but you know, I've realised something. She's not the boss. You're realising this just now? Yep. Not every day I've mentioned it. And Philip? He is so weird. How did I ever get involved with him? Do you know that he can't go to sleep unless he has his feet in a bucket of ice water? He watches them turn blue and then says, Dad, do you like? And passes out. He's so messed up. You know his sleeping patterns. <clears throat> of course you do. I'm taking back my $1,000 and I am joining the Scrub and Rug team in New Zealand. New Zealand? You should come with me. Scrub and Rug have opportunities for everyone. <laughs> I can't. Get back your $1,000 and buy a plane ticket. Oh my God. I could go with you. And then after your rebound period, because I've been on the internet researching rebound periods and there's no way I am making that mistake. After your rebound period, Maybe I could take you out to a nice New Zealand restaurant. I'd like that. This is our last day. This is our last day. This is our last day! <laughs> hey, have you seen us lately? Calling all the shots, even with the ninja roster. Time to know it's time to believe that the time is now that we're gonna make it bleed. Sarah. Gloves. Ugly shirt. Bucket. Special corset, all cleaners wear. Thank you. Look, you don't have to go. I promise I won't be weird anymore. Let's get you all nude as a gift. Not necessary. Working with you two has just been a hell beyond words. Philip, you should be kept behind glass. And no one should ever be allowed to talk to you unless they're stuck in the middle of a serial killing investigation. I'd probably tell them to look under a house with stilts. And Magda, you were a sad small human being. You are not the boss of this business. The fact that you envision yourself as the glorious leader of a company that scrubs toilets makes you probably the most pathetic person I've ever met in my life. Probably. If you could just give us back our $1,000, we'll be on our way. Oh, you don't get the money back. Of course we do, we're leaving. It went into setup costs, it's non-refundable. It was in the contract. Fine, whatever, we don't need it, come on. I... I can't leave without that money. The tax office found a small discrepancy with my returns. They were making me pay it back with the money I was earning from this job. I was gonna use that thousand dollars to skip the country. Sorry, can't help you. Well, okay, see you all later. We should thank the tax office. Get to keep you a little longer. Who's pathetic now? It's you, Magda, it is always you. You know, I can live with that. See you tomorrow, every day for the rest of your life. 9 a.m. sharp. We need to find a replacement for Libby. I'll give my brother a call. He just got out of prison for an orgy gone wrong. Sounds good. Daddy no like. <laughs>